Yo, what is going on, everybody? My name is Connor. You guys can call me Superior. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic Friday right now, doing something fun, eating corn dogs or something awesome like that. So, today's video is awesome. I'm going to be talking about the KF5 a little bit. I'm going to be breaking down some of the stats. I'm going to talk about the breakneck, and I'm going to talk about a KF5 enlisted variant that can compete with the breakneck, if not completely blow it out of the water so you guys have to stick around for the entire video i'm be covering a lot of information a lot of stats it's going to be extremely informative and hopefully by the end of this video we can all become a little bit better of a call of duty player uh you know in our own so if you guys enjoy the video and you want to do me a huge favor and hit the thumbs up button that'd be awesome thousand likes we hit it almost every video now it's extremely humbling and i appreciate all the support and if you guys are new to the channel and you want to hit the subscribe button just poke it uh, with you know whatever you want to poke it with and you know just subscribe that'd be greatly appreciated also nearing 200,000 subscribers dudes it literally I say the number and I start shaking that's ridiculous thank you for the support dudes let's get into this video I'm pumped for it. I think you guys are gonna enjoy it so uh, let's fucking do it so uh, the KF5 breakneck right that is in my eyes the best variant of the KF5 or at least on paper you know it is plus three fire rate minus one accuracy totally worth it great variant right so you hypothetically think it'd be the best, but I am here to tell you guys about a variant, in my opinion, that blows it out of the water, uh, if not, you know, equal equal with it. You know, it's pretty much the same gun, but uh, in my opinion, it's more accurate, and, uh, you know, that's more important than damage. And that variant, you're going to be seeing on your screen right now, that is the KF5 single stack. Now, you're looking at the single stack, you're like, superior, you're a dumbass, you know what I mean? It has plus one fire rate with minus one damage. How is that even on the same level as the breakneck that has plus three fire rate? So... Uh, the breakneck shoots at a 1,016 RPM, which means it shoots 1,016 bullets per minute, which is extremely fast if you couldn't tell. Now, the single stack, even though it only has plus one fire rate instead of plus three, also shoots at 1,016 rounds per minute. So they have extremely similar, actually not extremely similar, they have the exact same damn fire rate, all right? And one may say plus one fire rate, one may say plus three, but they do have the same 1,016 rounds per minute fire rate which you know makes it right that right there enough is alone to basically say uh they're the same gun because it is the only kf5 uh to have that freaking fast of a fire rate when the normal stock kf5 is shoots at 869 rounds per minute so it has nearly a 200 rounds per minute increase over the stock kf5 which is freaking ridiculous so uh the only other downside that the single stack has to it is the minus one damage but here's the thing and here's where i think the single stack makes up for that if you notice the breakneck is minus one accuracy uh when a gun has a plus three fire and shoots at a thousand and sixteen rounds per minute accuracy becomes a problem and when you take one accuracy off of the kf5 which already isn't the most accurate weapon in the game becomes extremely hard to aim with um and even if you don't even if it has more damage than the single stack uh you know you're not going to be hitting as many shots if you don't have that accuracy so in my opinion accuracy is more important than damage um when, it, when you're only talking about one bullet at long range so you know that's really not that big of a deal so i think the single stack that plus one accuracy or over the breakneck is extremely important you can be way more accurate at long range it is the exact same recoil pattern as the stock kf5 all right it shoots at 1016 rounds per minute but has the accuracy of a gun that only shoots at 800 rounds per minute which means for its fire rate it is the most accurate gun in the game um and it's definitely a weapon i recommend you guys try out so definitely if you get the single stack throw it on it is an enlisted variant which means it is way more common than the breakneck and you'll get it a hundred times before you get the kf5 breakneck and this is a gun that i notice that i'm consistently getting out of my supply drops certain enlisted weapons like the bal 27 carbon or the ak-12 hair trigger uh, i don't really see myself getting that given or giving them getting them that often you know i definitely see um a lot more single stacks than pretty much any other variant any other enlisted variant in the game unless it's a pair of damn knee pads because lord knows i have a million of those but the kf5 single stack one of the best guns in the game the gameplay you guys are actually watching is me on my 2.5 kd account on the xbox one which i literally never use unless i want to open supply drops uh and i end up going like 52 and 6 or something crazy like that against 
uh, an elite clan and a bunch of other, you know, highly skilled players. So it's absolutely crazy. This was just one of the first games I played with it. I played for a good hour, two hours with this class setup. And it was absolutely crazy. I think this class setup is awesome. I think you guys will enjoy it. And I definitely think you guys would come back to this video. Uh, and if you didn't like it at the beginning, I think you're going to come back and leave a like on it. Because this class is so much fun to use. And the K5 single stack is, you know, just as good as the breakneck. But in my opinion, I think it's better since it has the same fire rate. And, of course, is more accurate. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Click the thumbs up button. A thousand likes would be awesome. Subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Coming up on the big 200,000 subscriber marks. I love you all. Have a fantastic day, everybody. I'll see you guys in two more YouTube videos tomorrow. I think it's absolutely crazy that I'm actually keeping up with these double uploads. And I thank you guys for your support. Also, thank you for 30,000 followers on Twitter. I love you all. Dudes, have a fantastic day. I'll see you guys soon. Peace out.